Hello, this is Presh Talwakar. I am the author of Multiply Numbers by Drawing Lines. Please check out my book. It's the first text that's been written about this visual way to multiply numbers. In this video, I'm going to teach you a trick I discovered while writing the book, which is a rotation trick from the diagram. First, let's review how you multiply numbers by drawing lines. Let's say you want to multiply 12 by 13. For the 1 in 12, we'll draw one line. For the 2, we'll leave a little bit of space and draw two lines. For the other number, we'll draw lines in the other direction. Now we will group up intersections of the lines. On the far right, there are six intersections. In the middle, there are five intersections. And on the left, there's one intersection. These numbers tell you what the answer is. So 12 times 13 is 156. But there's a cool thing you can do now that you've drawn the diagram. Let's remove some of the labels. Now what we're going to do is rotate this entire diagram 90 degrees. And the thing I discovered is that you now get a new diagram and this can solve a new multiplication problem. Let's look at the lines that are going to the upper right. Here we have one line and then we have three lines. So that means the first number we're multiplying is 13. For the lines in the other direction, we have two lines followed by one line, which represents the number 21. So this diagram represents 13 times 21. We can again group the intersections that are vertically aligned. We have three on the right, seven in the center, and two on the left. And that gives us our answer that 13 times 21 is 273. And this is really cool. We've solved another problem from the same diagram we've already drawn. But we can even do more. Let's go ahead and rotate this diagram by 90 degrees once more. We now have a new diagram and we can solve another multiplication problem. The lines going up and to the right are two lines followed by one line, which is 21. The lines going to the bottom right are three lines and then one line. So that's 31. So this diagram represents 21 times 31. We'll now count up vertically aligned intersections. There's one on the right, five in the center, and six on the left. So that means 21 times 31 is 651. We're not done yet. We can do this one more time. We'll rotate the diagram 90 degrees. Now there's a pattern. Each time you rotate the diagram, it turns out that you're going to switch the two numbers and switch the digits in the second number. But let's go ahead and count the lines anyway. The line sloping up and to the right are three lines followed by one line for 31. The line sloping down and to the right are one followed by two, which is 12. We now count up the intersections. There's two on the right, seven in the center, and three on the left. So we have 31 times 12 is 372. If we rotate one more time, we're back to our original problem of 12 by 13. Now this one diagram can solve four different problem, problems depending on how you orient it. So it's really amazing that there's a hidden geometry to arithmetic. And even though millions have, of people have seen videos about multiplying numbers by drawing lines, this is the first time that a video has been made to show you how you can rotate the diagram and solve other problems. So this connects geometry and arithmetic in a completely unsurprising way. 
So it's a cool trick. I hope you like it and please share this video. If you enjoyed this concept, please check out my book, Multiply Numbers by Drawing Lines. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. I make videos on math and game theory. You can catch me on my blog, Mind Your Decisions. You can follow Mind Your Decisions on Facebook, Google Plus, and Patreon. You can also catch me at Presh Talwalker on Twitter, Instagram, Tumblr, and Pinterest. And you can get all of my books. There's a link in the video description.